Um, want to move on here to an entire chapter of the Hells Angels Motorcycle Club arrested as part of a kidnapping, robbery, and assault probe. We are talking five active members of the Bakersfield Hells Angels, including the group's president and vice president, plus two members of an affiliate club. Uh, law enforcement seizing around 25 firearms, ammunition, multiple high-capacity magazines, and gang affiliate paraphernalia. I want to bring in Morgan Chesky, who is on this for us. Uh, Morgan, what charges are these men facing? Uh, what do we know about this investigation? Yeah, yes, I mean, the question of charges here is somewhat fluid as the members of the club have not been formally charged just yet, but law enforcement officials do tell us that the litany of potential crimes here include kidnapping, robbery, making criminal threats, false imprisonment, assault with a firearm, participation in a criminal street gang, criminal conspiracy, intimidating a witness or victim, and elder abuse. Now, we've also learned one of the seven suspects, John Vaughn, was actually already in custody as a result of other charges. But all of these men are said to be from Bakersfield, California, that specific chapter. Authorities have identified those men as Ricardo Alvarez, Armando Villasenor, Joseph Soto Sr., Joseph Soto Jr., Joshua Savala, and John Seeger. And new photos in tonight, Yasmin, show some of the club paraphernalia that authority sees. In fact, you can see one photo denoting the group Sons of Hell. They, that's the affiliate club to the Hells Angels here. Other images show signage and club patches signifying the membership into this Bakerfield chapter. All of it just part of this really significant seizure that includes more than two dozen firearms. And important context, uh, federal charges could be coming, Yasmin. Uh, but at this point, it is still too early to tell. We can't talk about this, obviously, Morgan, without talking about the pretty controversial uh, history that the Hells Angels have. Of course. Yeah, certainly one of the most recognizable motorcycle gangs uh, in the country, if not the world here, Yasmin. And their history actually goes back nearly 80 years when they were founded in Fontana, California. That followed World War II. The DOJ officially designates the group as a motorcycle gang and criminal enterprise, alleging the Angels have long been involved in trafficking drugs and firearms. And you may know this, but one of the gang's most infamous moments came back in 1969 when the Angels were actually hired to work security at a concert at California's Altamont Speedway. Uh, the show, however, ended up in a deadly brawl with four people being killed. Uh, among them, an 18-year-old woman who had a gun that a club member stabbed to death. Uh, all of this happening as the Rolling Stones played on totally unaware. More recently, though, the group was tied to what's known as the River Run Riot. Uh, that was a clash with the rival gang, the Mongols, happening back in 2002 at Harris Casino in Laughlin, Nevada. Uh, that left three people dead and multiple people wow. injured, Yasmin. But in this specific case, still too early to tell, again, uh, what other charges could be coming at a higher federal level here. Yasmin. Morgan Chesky for us. Thank you, Morgan. Appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.